Hello and welcome! This video will show you how to connect Trictus Ethernet Communicator E14 to DSC panel PC1864. Open your browser and go to trictus.com. Here, click Products and then Ethernet. Select E14 product details. Download program Trictus Config and open E14 installation manual. Install Trictus Config Configuration Program. Open the communicator's casing with flathead screwdriver. Connect mini USB cable. Start the Trictus config program. In system settings window, select the panel type you are connecting. In our case, DSC PC1864. Go to user reporting window and select enable connection for a Protagus service. Press the buttons Write and Disconnect. Disconnect the USB cable. Close the communicator's casing. Wire the communicator to the control panel. Connect panel's AUX Plus contact to communicator's Plus DC contact. Connect panel's AUX minus contact to communicator's minus DC contact. Connect panel's YEL contact to communicator's CLK contact. Connect panel's GRN contact to communicator's data contact. Also, for arming and disarming the panel, connect the panel's zone that we will use as key switch zone to communicator's PGM output. This zone requires an end-of-line resistor. Connect LAN cable. Turn on panel's power supply. Now we need to program the panel with necessary settings. To enter the programming mode, press asterisk, then number 8 and enter installer code, default is 5555. Enter menu 001 and program the zone we connected to communicator's output as momentary key switch zone, setting 22. Press hash key to exit programming. The communicator E14 is now ready to send panel events to Protagus app and to remotely arm, disarm the panel. Go to protagus.eu forward slash login page and log in or register. In Systems window, press Add New System button. Enter Communicator's MAC address, which you can find on the backside of the communicator. Enter System Name and select the Time Zone.
Go to Areas and enter how many areas are in the system. To enable Remote Arm Disarm from Protagus, go to System Settings, Settings Menu, and selecting checkbox for Arm Disarm with PGM1. Choose Pulse Mode with 4 seconds. Go to Areas to Arm or Disarm the Security System. In Events window, you will see the history of events. Our installation is complete. Thank you for watching.